Franklin, he was kind of telling Franklin, like, you ain't got the company no more. You ain't got the, you ain't got the projects no more. You ain't got Skilling no more. He like, but I'm the plug. He like, let him know, I'm the plug. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's like, nigga, I'm the plug. what I got? Yeah, I'm the plug, nigga. And that's why I think, I saw, I think, if Franklin, to me, if I was Franklin, that's how I was spinning. Like, all right, nigga, if you ain't buying for me, you ain't buying for nobody else. Exactly. That you gonna be starving. You gonna if you think I'm gonna be starving. You gonna be starving out here too. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's why I think there'll be a way for them to be able to kind of coexist. They shift shift Leon to uh, to uh, to Arkansas, and I think that gives the show a little bit more of a range to go to because they can't just constantly be just dope, 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 dope in LA. Because especially you got yeah. the, you got the reporter on their back too. They don't even know about the reporter later yet. She on their back, and you just dope, dope, dope. And now if you move it to Arkansas, now you can show how they trying to build it from the ground up in Arkansas. You got a whole different aspect of the show. You kind of yeah. expand. You can breathe a little bit. You get new characters on the show, new character development. And I think that's how you push a show to another season because you can't just constantly just be in LA for season after season after season. And then you know, right. it's dying. Nobody in the show is really dying. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, nobody in the show dying, nobody getting no real heat from the police. And, and I know, you know, they got uh, 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 Reed, Reed kind of sheltering them from, the, yeah. from that part of it, you know what I mean? But still, I mean, like somebody got to, like you said, somebody got to go. Somebody got to go, bro. Some, and that, that, that kind of gives a, a realization to the show a little bit. Even though we know it's a, it's a TV show and it's all written, but they kind of right. give a little realization to the show when somebody actually dies that's really pivotal in the show. Because that's how you kind of, you have that moment in the show, like, ah, then you got to see what they're going to do after this. Like, can they put what's the storyline going to be after the fact? Because that's why yeah. I think they're going to continue to build that real estate, the real estate investor, you know, to continue to build with him, move to Arkansas, patch it up with Man Boy, let Leon and, and maybe Jerome or somebody, probably not Jerome, he's probably going to go out there because he got his old lady there, but probably Leon and another another soldier build some Fat Boy. So, yeah. I think they're going to get Fat Boy up, though. Yeah, they even, might- though, even though they know, uh, even though Scully Girl know that it was Leon that pulled the trigger, they're gonna get fat boy up. They're gonna try to be like, oh, fat boy did it. You know, fat boy, you know, but they're gonna have to get, like you said, somebody gonna got to go. Yeah, somebody gotta die, bro. Somebody somebody gotta die in the show for the show to continue to feel as authentic as it is. You know, it feels authentic now, but until somebody if somebody if somebody doesn't die, then I'll be like, okay, man, what's up? What's up, the right? Y'all gotta, yeah, I was kind of true to the story. Let's exactly. go on. Somebody important in the show gotta gotta go. And then you kind of push a show. And that's kind of like like any kind of good show like that. When somebody really pivotal in the show dies, they really push the show forward because you feel it. You feel it. You know what I'm saying? We feel yeah. it when that important character die. And then, yep. you, like, then you go on to the next the next episodes and you kind of feel like the aftermath of that. Then you push the show forward and you kind of grow. And that's how the show continues to grow. So until yeah, yeah. Happens, I think it's going to be, you can't just keep running around in the same city. You know, yeah. three, three hitters just can't keep running around in the same city. Yeah, and keep and, and they keep barely missing. Everybody know, everybody know everybody live, cause they just went sat on they went sat on uh, Leon Korea just like they like. What y'all gonna do? Nah, we already got it in motion. Uh, we I want this handle now. That's what the, what the girlfriend said. Yeah, just go sit on yeah. it. And he come up, you know what I'm saying? Coming he, up there, yeah. they know where he at, bro. I'm like, Skull ain't no hitter like he's supposed to, bro. He got a sawed off shotgun sitting in the car screaming across the yard, bro. Yeah, bro. You nigga try to shoot that man. That nigga 60 yards away trying to shoot it with a sawed off shotgun. Like, bro, what you doing, bro? They sp- yeah. Hey, nigga. I'm like, bro. He looks so out of shape chasing behind him. When you, when he, uh, he looks so out of shape, bro. Yeah. Shape. So out of shape running with the sawed off in his head. Hey, he's like, you know, hey, you know, that ain't, that ain't Scully. That ain't Scully. Uh, that ain't Scully roll right there. Like, this nigga trying to. I know. <laughs> yeah, bro. I don't, I don't know. It's like they have, like you said, the show. They have so many different things going on, and it's like we only seen Mel for half a show. Yeah, and it's like then she was gone. Oh, I got it. The reporter gonna go back to Mel. You know when the when the uh the new the new um the editor was like, you gotta find somebody who's willing to talk and willing to give up. So I think right. she'll be the piece that they need to talk. You know, what I'm saying to corroborate and give talk about what Franklin Empire, what Franklin's been doing. And then you get the two dope boys, the two the, the two kingpins that they got. Yeah, they got, the Colombian the Colombian boys or whatever, the Venezuelan boys. Got the two Colombian boys locked up in jail. She finna really be pressuring that. Now she got a team behind. You know, saying the whole paper kind of behind the story. Now, you know, Reed about to kill all them. I don't know if he can, bro. That's a lot, bro. That's a lot. Of, that's a lot of killing to cover. That's a lot to cover up, bro. But Reed about to have the two Colombian boys killed in jail. That's easy. That's the easy mark right there. Yeah, you can get to. 
can get to him in jail. Yeah, he gonna be, they gonna be knocked off, and and and, and man, they gonna and Reed gonna mess around to find who that reporter is. Cause remember, they, remember they they was like they dropped that cause she got a daughter. You find like, and she he gonna be like, hey, I feel like, you know Reed is, sh- is sh- man, you got, Reed is shady. Cause you got this Gustavo, you know what I'm saying? He just got locked up. He owe Reed one. He owe him. Oh Reed, yeah. He oh, fucking around and send Gustavo over there to mess with. Cause I ain't get that whole. I ain't get that whole. Um, why would we get? Why would he? Why would Gustavo get locked up like that? You know what I'm saying? Because she called police. Show up that fast. Police never show up that fast. Of course, there's TV. TV land. Yeah, yeah. And he screamed through the door. They come in. All of a sudden, they think you know he on the floor. He locked up. He out the next day. He talking about he. You know what I'm saying? He he want to apologize or whatever, whatever. He owe him one. And then he talking about he want him to go find. You know what I'm saying? His girlfriend. Yeah, yeah. It's been the past, man. Nah, you know, you know, uh, Gustavo probably, you know, he probably was still feeling it from his from his cousin, his cousin and his girl getting killed, and then, uh, uh, you know, he think he he think it's shit. I work for the CIA, and then I'm untouchable. Oh. I remember that's what he said when the cop came in, like, man, get your ass off me. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, you know who I am? You know, and the cops was like, man, get your ass out. He took you know took him down to the downtown, as they say. But man, like you said, I feel like Reed. Man, because got read us Gustavo. You know he'll hit him and he owe him yeah. one. So he, he gonna go one. whatever he want now. And and I could I could be mistaken, but remember the reporter had all their pictures up on the wall. I didn't see Gustavo's picture up there. I could be mistaken. I don't think they know about Gustavo yet. I don't because he hadn't he's he hasn't been in the picture at all. He hasn't been in the picture at all. So I don't think Yeah. They, see? So he Reed could send Gustavo and she wouldn't even see him coming. She don't even know what he looked like. Not at all, bro. Gustavo, you know, he, he don't care. He'll hit him. He'll go get it done. Hey, go get it done. Like, especially if Reed be like, hey, I found uh uh your old girlfriend, but you yeah. gotta do this for me. You gotta do you it. Owe me. You owe me. He gonna you know? he gonna probably go on over there. Man, easy. You know, you know, Gustavo old old oh what they call the uh the Mexican wrestlers, he old Lichador or whatever. <laughs> yeah, he's talking yeah. About. Hey, he'll go over there, nigga, strangle her out. Then no gun, nothing. You won't hear nothing. Just choke her out. Choke her out, bro. Yeah, man. She 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 digging, she digging, she digging a little too deep, man. And then they what's the name? Um the old uh agent gave gave her all the files. She got all they all they faces up on the on I said, oh, it's over. She about to get murked. It's only a matter of time. Can't uncover that, bro, and and then think it's just gonna go silently into silent into the night, bro. It's not gonna happen, you know. And see, yeah. I, oh, they gonna they gonna get rid of her, bro. They gonna have to get rid of. Yeah. Her. You can't that can't come to light. You can't let nothing. Can't come to light. Yeah, the CIA making too much money off this coke. You bringing coke into the city. You bringing coke into the U.S. Selling it, using the money to go fund the war. Oh, bro, it ain't uh, uh nah, they ain't, yeah. it, they ain't going. As soon as they try to publish that, it's it's man, they they probably ain't gonna get it that far. Not they get that. Because at some point you're gonna it's gonna be some noise being made and re and re gonna catch wind of it. You know what I'm saying? Re yep. gonna catch wind of it and be like, hey, we gotta go shut this down. He gonna go, you know, he gonna go he'll probably mess around and do it himself. You know, he he'll look he'll look slick little hitter too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Read <laughs> he'll look slick. Yeah, he'll probably do it himself. Yep. Only thing I only thing I was saying he might not because they got his face. You know what he looks like. You know yeah. what I mean? So they ever some fuck around. Like you said, they're sitting uh uh Gustavo over there. Gustavo, yeah. that's why he got him on the team. You know, he got a, he got somebody that in the back pocket. He a killer. He know he a killer. He owe him. You know what I'm saying? Because Gustavo, you know, Gustavo ain't gonna say nothing. He ain't gonna say nothing because he in for the long haul now. You know what I'm saying? Because Reed got the dope. Yep. Yep. Oh man, he got yeah, man. So that's that's a, and that's another thing. I'm like, come on, Franklin. You got too much. I know he don't he don't know about the reporter and what she got yet, but you know the police on you. Cause they're on Leon. They're they on, on Leon. You know what I mean? And you're an associate, so you got to run from the police. I feel like Man Boy and Scully is the lesser of the, of the evil. Yeah. Like it's, it'd be harder. Like, like Reed came back and said, "Yo, we have, we have. Uh, they got, they got Leon's prints." But you, you I mean, it's kind of hard. You can't go fight the police, but you, you know, it's kind of hard for him to put a plan up to deal with them if you got these two boys, Scully and Man Boy, coming at you. Yep. You know, you gotta worry about that too. It's like you gotta handle something. You gotta, you gotta take something out. Somebody gotta, you gotta take some chips off the table. You know what I mean? I think he can kind of maneuver through Reed to get the evidence, um, kind of lost in paperwork with, um, with uh, uh, Leon's fingerprints on the bullets or whatnot. 
and then they can, I'm just thinking, they can frame Fat, fat Boy, let them, you know what I'm saying, tell Fat Boy, hey, look, man, you're going to take this bid, we're going to take care of the family, we're going to take care of everything, you get out, you're going to be straight, shift, shift Leon to Arkansas, patch it up with, with um, a man boy, man boy, go take over Scully Old Blocks, you got the city back shut down, and you move it now you're moving way through Arkansas. You know what I'm saying? Cause you gotta think about they gotta think about logistics now. You gotta think because you know all the dope just been coming straight from from uh from Reed, dropping off in the mm -hmm. trunk, getting it to uh getting to Franklin. Franklin now, yeah. About logistics, like how are we gonna get this dope into Arkansas? You know what I'm saying? Like how are you gonna get the dope to Arkansas? You ain't, you can't fly it in, you're gonna have to drive it in or something. Yeah, you gotta have some mule. Now you gotta go move yeah. the dope. So that's a whole new aspect of the show. You know what I mean? That he ain't even that he ain't got no experience with. Ain't got no experience. You got that's a that's a that's a long trip. You going from Cali, from LA to Arkansas. You gotta go cross them border. And, and, and bro, what's that? That's back in the '80s. Police gonna pull you over for nothing. For nothing, bro. bro, bro boy, you got a black boy in, in in what? Arkansas, why or whatever in between? Oh, it, it's no hey, they pull you over for nothing. Yeah, bro, it's going down. So he got to he got to first get, take care of home. Like I said, he can he got to just pay. You got to just pay off. Uh, you got to pay him off. He got to pay off. You got to pay off, man, boy. And then what thing is he got to pay off the girlfriend? You know what I'm saying? You got to get her quiet. You know what I mean? Cause she want to. But how much money? How much money you think they gonna be able to give for killing this, her daughter though? Fifty. Brother. To a hundred thousand. Hundred thousand. Don't cost him a hundred thousand. Minimum hundred thousand. Fifty to hundred thousand minimum. Okay, I don't know if you can trust that. <clears throat> fucking Scully, fucking around, be done, put that shit in his ear, start thinking about a daughter and try to shoot everybody. About it. Even after you be like, all right, we good. I gave you these bricks. I paid you. We good. Man, he's Scully, fucking around. You got you to gotta take Scully out. You got to take Scully out. You gotta yeah, man. You got to Scully out, pay man boy, and then pay the, and pay, and pay the baby mama off. You know what I'm saying? You got to put, you gotta, that's how you got to, that's how you got to do it. Like, look, it went down. He got 100,000. You know what I'm saying? You gotta let man boy do it though. Let man boy smooth it over. You know what I'm saying? Like Franklin ain't gonna be able to do it. You know what I'm saying? Cause yeah. she gonna she gonna be too too angry and too upset. Yeah, up. too emotional. Uh, in you situation. know what I'm saying? So, but a man boy like, look, we got the blocks. We got skillet blocks. We're gonna take over the hood. I'm gonna take care of you. You know what I'm saying? He go a hundred thousand. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do that. Then they could probably ease the blow. You know what I mean? And kind of move on. You know, especially with skillet did. They can take over the whole hood. He can, you know what I'm saying? Man, boy can go Hell take Hell no. I don't think, I don't, man, I don't think she gonna do it. First, like, first you, first you kill my daughter, then you kill my dude? And she gonna be like, cause she, to oh, me, I, she seemed like she did. Oh, I can kill you next. <laughs> oh, you can step up and you can run, you can run Scully Blocks. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Or, you can step up, you know what I'm saying? You can run Scully Blocks. Or we can do you like we did Scully. True. Hey, that's what I, I, that's I, that's how he gonna have to put it. Uh, Cause I think leaving he too he too on the fence though. He he got to either get gritty with it or get out the business. You can't be yeah. just a good yeah. in a dope business. You can't yeah. do it. Yeah, he, he yeah yeah he he trying he trying like you said he trying to be and he too close to it like bro.